like they said on uh, Armageddon, none of my guys want to pay taxes ever again. And my version of that, and even, I mean, I guess sort of the staging of it, and, you know, Michael Bay knows how to make something dramatic or maybe melodramatic anyway, at least. Uh, although Pain and Gain is a, I thought it was almost a masterpiece, if not a masterpiece one. In fact, I might, uh, if I see it out, out tonight, I might buy it. But nevertheless, uh, my, uh, fuck, I might buy Armageddon. But, uh, and nevertheless, Michael Bay perhaps made that scene naturally dramatic enough with the timing and the music and the staging and the shots and the, and maybe Bruce Willis is acting or whatever it is to be even dramatic for like a six year old or did it come out in 1998? I think I was, I saw it in theaters and I remember seeing it and being like, oh wow, like I don't even really know what taxes are. Like, I, re I think I remember actually not really understanding what he meant by the line. And yet, um, I still remember feeling the impact of it, whether or not I knew exactly, like, oh, you know what? I think I remember thinking of, like, oh, like, they don't want to pay sales tax because that's what... I had known of as taxes and so I think I think I had even thought of like like oh they're so they're not gonna how are they gonna do that like are they gonna have a card that maybe I thought of this back then like are they gonna have a card that they take everywhere with them that they don't have to like <coughs> how do you not pay sales tax anymore everywhere you go I <coughs> And I think I thought, <coughs> anyway, that I, um, I don't know. Anyway, this is my example of that, or my version of that, which is, um, I'm not going to wear the mask, a mask, ever again, right? Because there's no reason for me to. I'm not a doctor. I'm not going to be a fucking doctor. There's literally... Before all this insanity was thrust and brought upon us and developed all around us and in us and uh, amongst us like a uh, fucking plague in amongst itself, right? Which is kind of funny and ironical about it. Um, the whole pandemic thing. Before all that, you know, like I, it's funny. I When I saw an Asian person walking down the street wearing one of those masks, I would think like, are they diseased? Like, because they did that back in the mid-2000s or so, and they you, every once in a while you'd see an Asian person, like someone actually, not like just any person of Asian descent or heritage, but someone, I guess, actually from Asia or something, closely connected enough with that society in China, I guess it was specifically, or maybe many places in Asia, I don't know. I had a boss who told me that, people in Japan were doing it as well. Maybe or maybe not, I don't know. I take what he says with a grain of salt, but he was a nice enough guy or is one. But anyway, uh, I would, like, I'd think, like, when they were doing that, I'd think, like, oh, like, are they, is there something wrong with them? Like, do they have a real reason to do this? And the answer is no. Of course, it was no. It was never, it was not that they had a real reason to do this. It was that, they were brainwashed earlier than we were into a way of thinking that caused them to wear those stupid fucking surgical masks everywhere they went, or cloth masks or anything, whatever it is, or was, anyway. And so, there's no reason, there was never a reason in my entire life, in my entire whole life, from my entire human life as Matt, having, after having been born, and of course before having been born as well, for me to wear one of those stupid surgical masks, or whatever it is. No, except for Halloween, for me wearing like a fun mask or anything, there was never any reason, or like maybe if I'm in a play or something, or dressing up for some reason, or in some way, there was never any reason 
fully, total for me to ever wear any mask like that, right? Never. From the moment I was born and before then, from the moment of my conception and going back, unless I was a doctor in some past life or there was some legitimate reason or I was wearing some kind of like goalie mask at some point or something with a legitimate reason, there was never any reason to wear a mask like that for some kind of disease awareness prevention type thing, right? I think there was never any real reason to and therefore there's never, I can guarantee, I would bet, I would stake my fucking life on it. There's never going to be a legitimate reason for me to do so uh, ever again, except as some kind of imposition of force on me or upon me. And so I'm not going to do it anymore, ever.